YouTube. So Chris and I, we are on our way to um, double date happy hour at Applebee's with our friends. Um, today I uploaded a new intro for the channel, so hopefully you can check that out. Um, but we are going to start vlogging again, and I'm pretty excited about that because we've taken about a year off. I think two years since our last vlog, so we're going to start posting um, pretty soon. And it's going to be a combination of like footage from myself and then footage from Chris when he's with the kids. Um, because, um, not that I've made an update yet, but our lifestyle has completely changed since the last time you visited us. So I'm kind of hungry because I kind of skipped out on dinner. So we'll see if I get an appetizer or a full meal. So stay tuned. Here's a real quick Costco haul. Snacks for the kids. Go-Gurts. Salad, because Chris and I are getting back on track with keto clementines, right? Yep. Strawberries. Bacon, because, you know, keto. Mango and peach salsa. Steak strip. Oh, this is Chris's. Um, beef jerky. String cheese. We bought these pizzas. They're not um, for Chris and I. We got these Cholulas. They're only $7.99 for two. And these are the big bottles. And typically they're for something. Or around $4 for the smaller bottles. So we got these bigger bottles. We bought some celery sticks for mostly keto. We have some sweet red chili for eggs in the morning. Even though I believe that's probably not... Definitely not keto. Uh, we have these Angus Choice Burgers, and if you haven't bought these yet, you need to. They're the fastest cooking beef patties you could buy because you can put them in the microwave. Um, you could also grill them, but we, I like to bring them to work because I can just microwave them at work, and literally it tastes like it just came right off of the grill. A uh, vegetable bag because I do this with the hamburger patties and chicken. We have chicken down there chicken thighs uh i got some breakfast sausage corn dogs those are for the kids uh they had these for 4.49 for a three pack uh we got large eggs they're like nine dollars for 60 uh milk and garlic because i ran out and we need garlic for everything oh and then uh this olive garden italian dressing what I liked about this is it has 80 calories per serving, serving, and then it only has two carbs in it. Um, yes, it has two grams of sugar, but you can't go wrong, especially with other dressings that are out there. So I can't wait to try this. Um, I don't know what it tastes like, so if you have tasted it, let me know if you like it. Um, we bought some applesauce pouches and some Capri Sun for kids lunches because um they're getting kind of expensive at school now so their lunches have gone up oh yeah and then we bought oatmeal because it's winter and pretty much winter in washington and my kids love it so what are you doing right now uh, i'm trying to pick out a book for our book fair coming up which one do you want i want the die wimpy kid the meltdown so alessandro's birthday is next week he's going to be 10 years old how do you feel uh-huh. I, I, I'm getting older by the years. Getting older by the years? Getting taller, too. And taller. Yeah, he grew, like, so many inches. Alright, so... I think what I'm gonna do today is vlog an entire day, um, as life... as a working mom. Um, and with your husband being gone for the weekend. So, uh, Chris is at the reserves this weekend, so... I just came off of graveyard, meaning 
I worked from 11 o'clock last night till 7 a.m. It's 7 a.m. right now in Washington, and it's super dark and foggy, as you can see. So, um, yeah, I'm going to have to stay awake when I get home um, because the boys have a soccer game today that I have to get them ready for. So, yay, wish me luck. So I just made it home. Uh, it's about 7.30 and I will be checking to see if the boys are awake because I have to get them ready for soccer. I'll get their water bottles ready. I'll make them breakfast, make sure their uniforms are on. And um, Chris is at the reserve, but he's going to try and see if he can um, get out of work to come pick the boys up because he does coach them in soccer at the Y. So, um, it'll be a busy morning. The boys are usually really good about letting me lay down for like an hour or two. They are eight and nine years old, so typically I'll lay down on the couch and they'll watch TV or something, or they'll play, um, Wii. So, uh, it'll be a tired morning, but I'm not that worried about it because I have all night to sleep. I don't have to be back to work until tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. So I do have time to rest. Um, I was asked if I could do another shift tonight at 3, uh, but since Chris will be at the reserve, I don't have anyone to watch the kids. And um, yeah, so I had to say no to that. I would have gotten tomorrow off, but that's okay. Not that big of a deal. So I will see you soon. So I thought the kids were going to be awake, but they're asleep. And I'm not going to wake them up. I'm just going to set my alarm on. Wake up around 9.30 and get them ready for soccer. So I didn't make it to the soccer game. I was passed out. Yeah, so they have two more games, so if you wanted to show up. Uh, Chris just got back from their soccer game. He actually coached in his uniform. So what happened at your soccer game today? I scored two goals. You scored two goals? And then, hmm, one, the first goal is when I dribbled it past everyone. Mm -hmm. I took a shot and scored. Then the second one, when we got a kickoff because the goalie grabbed it. Outside. Why are you spinning around in circles? I don't know why. So it's currently 1.15, and like I said before, I didn't make it to the boys' soccer game, but um, they just got back home. I'm awake, sort of, kind of exhausted still, um, but I'm making coffee, making the kids lunch, and we'll see where we go from there, but I honestly didn't even hear Chris come home to pick the boys up. Uh, Kayla had gone to work at like around 10, and that's around the same time Chris got home, um, so he just picked the kids up, took off to soccer and um yeah now I'm awake and I'll stay awake until probably later this afternoon I'll take a nap um but I don't know yet because I'll end up sleeping all night tonight to go to work tomorrow at um seven so um I know my schedule seems a little crazy but totally worth it because I'm home now with the kids on most days actually every day now Most of my day is spent doing this. Laundry. So it's definitely turned fall. These are all of our trees in our backyard. So it's about two o'clock and I was making the kids their lunch. Um, but this is my, technically my breakfast. Um, so I have four little, tiny little sausages. Um, and I have some eggs with mushrooms and onions. So I am trying kind of a lazy keto, not counting macros or counting any of that. So kind of try to stay within what I know. So, and it's all cooked in coconut, uh, coconut oil. 